Hey, Cinder, how you doing? I could listen to this music forever. But we're not going to. We are going to play more shit. Uh, let's see here. It always defaults to one. Where the hell I was? Okay, there we go. Pandora's room. You shut up, Chibi. It comes in. <laughs> shut up and kiss me, you fool. Uh, okay, let's see here. Um, let's get going. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I forgot what I'm doing. Quests. Right, they're going to cast the chest service. Explore to your heart's content and speak to uh, Azrael when you're ready to proceed. Okay, so let's explore the castle. Lord Ragnarok. Oh. Damien's room. Minus room. Oh god, what is the... Why does she have a jacuzzi? Just look at you, Pandy. If you keep overworking yourself like that, you're going to get premature wrinkles. Hold on a second, I'm gonna check something out real quick. Seems loud, I don't know why. Hmm. Anyway. Why not kick back and go for a little soak with me? It'll be just like old times. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh my, I, uh... Okay, I'm ready to turn it off in case it's not Twitch appropriate. <laughs> That's the spirit. <laughs> I know I'm going to regret this. Oh, it's just little. <laughs> I cannot believe like you talk me into this. Oh god, they just they just colored her shirt flesh colored. Puss Pandy. We see this all the time when you were little. Yes, and it was awkward back then as well. <laughs> You're so adorable when you embarrassed, Pandy. Your face still gets as red as a tomato. Oh my god, this is hilarious. Just be quiet. How am I supposed to relax with you chattering in my ear? Crimson! <laughs> you did remember to lock the door, didn't you? Oh. Whoopsie! Oh god, he's coming in. I hate you. <laughs> I've been fully healed. Oh, cool! That was fun, Pandy. Let's do it again real soon. Honestly, I don't even know why I humor that insufferable succubus. Oh, that was hilarious. I guess some of those clothes are tried, but they'll cover far too much skin. I could have possibly denied the world my stunning visage. I might try one of those maid outfits later, though. <laughs> Be strong, Damien. Be strong. <laughs> now this looks comfy. I think I'll put my feet up for a bit. Make yourself at home, tasty boy. I'll be sure to make you as comfortable as possible. Then again, the world's not gonna go conquer itself. Let's get going. <laughs> be strong, Damien, be strong. You know, Penny, you're not actually that bad looking for a human. There's no way you could compete with a succubus. <sighs> Everything is a beauty contest with you. Alright. Net. Table. Oh, uh, Damien's the, uh, descendant of, uh, Reinhardt, who was the original dark mage that released Ragnarok into the world. Oh, did you want to have some tea or something, dear? As is a little light on snacks, I'm afraid. It's in the pot. I dare not look inside one of these. Alright. How the hell do I know what? Because the game told me it. It was like one of the first things that Ragnarok mentioned. Oh, by the way, Reinhardt's descendant is in, 
uh, Reddit town. <laughs> Servants' quarters. Same thing the help gets to relax once in a while. Hmm? I wouldn't have expected this from someone like Asriel. Oh look, they have a mirror. How adorable. It's almost as if they think they can do something to make their pitifully under underdeveloped bodies less bland. You can be rather cruel sometimes. I'm surprised when it's filled with maid outfits. Hmm? One seems to be missing. <sighs> Lanith. Hey, I'm innocent until proven guilty. Besides, I look far more stunning in that outfit than any of those ratty maids. I begin to wish I had summoned an ogre as my guardian instead. Soldiers. So, five more minutes. Hey, Lanith! You wanna go on scouting duty with me? As much fun as staring at endless darkness for hours on end sounds, I'm afraid I'll have to pass. Hm. Find it, sour puss. Oh, just look at you. So big and strong. How about a little smooch, handsome? Barak, oh god, Crimson. I was your kind's trick, succubus. Be gone before I swat you like the insect you are. Hm. You're lost. You smell like a minotaur's behind, by the way. Me not so sure he can win. Lord Ragnarok lose to puny humans before. Now he weaker than Lumio. Oh shit. L Lord Ragnarok! Utter such blasphemy again, and I will personally send your soul to the deepest, darkest chasm of the abyss for eternity. Yes, me lord! Yes, me lord! You hear? Lord Ragnarok finally returned! Now we take over human rule for sure! Hmm. First thing we do when we get there is eat all that delicious human food! Lanith, Lord Azriel actually let you in here? Oh yes. I've become one of Ragnarok's most valuable servants. I even have my own room with the jacuzzi. Try not to be too jealous. Mm. Who's this? You humans take so many things for granted. This world is a living nightmare. Can you imagine living in a world where you or your loved ones could be devoured by beasts at any time? That is reality for us demons. Uh, too bad I don't care. I don't know as much of a view. I'm going to stare at that endless darkness. Us demons gotta stick together. Hey, yuck. Behind this door, Lord Azrael's private quarters. You better keep your distance if you don't want to die. Ooh, storage room. Most human looking. <laughs> oh, God, you're right. Get lost, human. I don't care what Ragnarok says. I'll never accept you. You don't have to accept me. You just have to do as I command. Insubordination means death. Remember that. Hey, Great Gamer, how you doing? Is it true? Has Lord Ragnarok truly returned after all this time? At last, the human realm will fall into our grasp. We demons have been waiting for eternity and eternity for this moment. Human, you can open portals from the best your realm, isn't that right? So I'm just big, one big enough to portal to transport us all. Keeping the presence of an entire demon army tethered to the mortal plane is beyond my abilities. Not that it should be of any, your, any of your concern. It has, great, it has. Just keep your head down and do as you're told like a good little underling. Look around, can I take anything? Come on, give me stuff. God damn it. <laughs> Comparing human weaponry to that of us demons like comparing a sword to a butter knife. Storage room, but I can't take anything. What the F? Okay, well, we explored around enough. Let's go talk to uh, Azrael. <sighs> Monster Kettle, Living Quarters, Dungeon. So. It seems to take your eyes from you now, though I'm loath to admit it. Do me a favor, bring any prisoners you can find. It's been far too long since I've had heard the wonderful, ear piercing screams of a tortured soul. I'll see what I can do. 
<laughs> okay, it's later, Grace. Take care, man. Alright, let's just go to the throne room. Oh, fuck you, Jibby. God damn it. If you finish wasting time, let's put Lord Ragnarok's plans into motion. Hold on a minute. Hurry it up, human. We're here to serve Lord Ragnarok, not to sightsee. Gotta be away. Oh yeah, we were gonna do the scenario, that's right. Growing up with a succubus. <clears throat> the music. The time has come, child. If you wish to continue living, you must summon a demon from the abyss to serve as your guardian. But I thought you were gonna protect me. In this loathsome form, I'm only able to release my power in short bursts. Summoning that power severely weakens my soul. As such, it must be used sparingly. I must lie dormant in your soul, feeding off your darkness in order to recover my strength. Mr. Ragnarok, what does darkness taste like? Enough! <laughs> uh, like black cherry. Like black cherry soda. How about that? Oh, or dark chocolate. Oh. Enough. Do as I command and summon forth a demon. Such a task will be well within your power. Concentrate in your darkness. Harness your hatred and let it manifest into power. Then, unleash it all at once. You're so chippy. I'll, I'll try. And we brought it forth. Yay, I did it! A succubus in a bikini. What the? This looks like... The human realm. Oh, this is absolutely delicious. Finally, a chance to have some real fun. There was a lucky man who called me to this realm. I'm sure he showed my appreciation the only way I know how. Uh, um, hello? Hi, Miss Demon. I'm Le I mean, Pandora. It it's nice to meet you. What's with this kid? Where's the person who summoned me? Out with it. Um, I summoned you, Miss Demon. You're telling me I was summoned by a kindergartner? Is this some kind of joke? <sighs> and here I was getting excited. What a disappointment. I suppose you should be grateful to you for calling me here. But the thing is, I can't stand little brats like you. Huh? You see, I hate women, no matter what age they are. They're always trying to steal away my food with their plebeian human bodies and dull charms. All the men of this world belong to me. I don't need any competition. That's why... I'm afraid I'm going to have to kill you now. What? what? Shh, they have kindergartners in... They have kindergartens in uh, the demon world. Shh. Oh, don't take it personally, sweetie. It's just a policy of mine. You understand. No, no! Get away! Well, still now. This will only sting for a moment. Stay your hand, demon. This mortal belongs to me. Oh, and who might you be? I'm Ragnarok, Lord of the Abyss and God of Darkness. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a good one. You, Lord Ragnarok. Ragnarok right went missing centuries ago. They say he disappeared after being sent back to the abyss with his tail between his legs by a handful of humans. Do you honestly be expect me to believe a tiny thing like you could be Ragnarok? Oh, that's rich. Yeah, the, be the beginning was super cheesy. And the maps need a bit of work, but I mean, this is a decent game. I like it. I thought you said doing that made you get all weak. It was well worth the effort. Uh, make it stop! Make it stop! I trust you've learned your place. Pain is the most effective of all instructors, after all. 
Yes, yes, you're Ragnarok. Just don't roast me anymore. What is it you want from me exactly, my lord? I devised a plan to take vengeance upon Lumiel and her beloved humans. This child is pivotal to my plans, thus I am tasking you with her safety. When she summons you to her side, obey her every command. With all due respect, my lord, Succubi don't make very good babysitters. Perhaps someone else would be more qualified to... Silence! I have spoken. Do as I say or I will ensure that every waking moment of your pitiful existence is filled with agony. Like I said, just leave everything to me. Growing up with succubus. Curse that human brat. Of all the succubus in the abyss, why do you have to summon me? If only I could kill that tyrannical little cyclops, I'd be free of this mess. What do you want now? Could, could you read me a bedtime story? <laughs> Please? You're actually serious, aren't you? It's just, my mommy used to read me a bedtime story before I went to sleep. Do I look like your mommy? No, why? Listen, sweetie, you're a servant of Ragnarok now. That means no more tuckins, no more goodnight kisses, and no more bedtime stories. It is cute. Just forget about everything that isn't related to killing people. But, but I... Spare me the tears. If it were my choice, you wouldn't even be breathing right now. Now send me back. I have better things to do than play nursemaid to a human. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> my tummy hurts. Oh god. I can't reach the shelf. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ. Let's have a tea party! Oh, fuck. I swear, if that brat summons me one more time, I'm going to tear her throat out. If any of the other succubi were to hear about this, I'd never live it down. Ugh, my sisters will never let me hear the end of it. Oh, God. Oh, for the love of what? What could you possibly want now? H help me. I knew it! She really is a dark mage! Oh my, and what have we here? Three delectable looking young men. Finally, something worth my time. So stay back, you monster! I'm warning you! Oh, don't be shy. I just want to get to know you a little better is all. Why don't you come a little closer? <laughs> oh, what a magnificent creature. And that's it, boys. Now come here and give me a hug. <laughs> oh, it's been so long since I've tasted the sweet flavor of human life force. Absolutely intoxicating. It looks like this job has its perks after all. Um, th thank you. Listen up, you little runt. I've had just about all I can stand if you summon me so frivolously. From now on, only call me if there are men for me to devour. That means no more tea time, no more play time, and no more chores. I'm a deadly soul-sucking demon, not a nanny. Hey, Zemsi, how you doing? I'm sorry, it's just... You're the only friend I have. Um, what? Mr. Ragnarok's really scary, and Draco doesn't talk, so I just don't want to be lonely anymore. Listen, sweetie, I am not your friend. In fact, if it was over the prospect of immediate incineration by Ragnarok, I would tear your heart out of your adorably flat little chest right now. Liar! Excuse me? You're a liar! If you were my friend, you wouldn't have protected me from the bad guys! First of all, sweetie, we're the bad guys. 
Second, the only reason I did that was because Lord Ragnarok would fillet me if I let anything happen to his pet. I love you. Oh god, taxes. And third, you are the most infuriating, unlikable, whiny little crybaby of a human that's ever been my displeasure to come into contact with. Liar. You're a big fat liar! Must restrain urge to kill. Oh my god. Finally. I thought she'd never fall asleep. What annoying little brat. Well, well, my parents are dead. If she grew up in the abyss like I did, she'd know what real hardship is like. She's too busy bawling her eyes out to even bother sending me back. What a pain. That's right. She didn't send me back. It's my chance to spread my wings and have a little fun. I'll go on a little life-eating binge before the brat has a chance to summon me again. Oh, Lanneth, you're absolutely brilliant. Oh my, I've hit the jackpot already. This really must be my lucky night. So boys, who wants to be first to become my midnight snack? Succubus, this must be the creature responsible for the others' disappearance. Oh, you mean those other little morsels I devoured earlier? They're also very delicious. But don't worry, they all died happy. Just as you will. We, we may need backup for this. We need to hurry and call reinforcements from the other unit. Splitting up wasn't a wise idea after all. Other unit? Shoot, the girl! Where do you go, demon? Do you mean we just let you walk away after what you've done? And here is actually going to let you live. You stupid humans just never learn your lesson, do you? That is a good question, Cinder. I don't know if the game addresses it. I have time to feed on all of you. Sometimes I'll just have to kill you the old-fashioned way. Listen! <laughs> it was you, wasn't it? You're the one who slaughtered our comrades! We discovered the remains right outside this shack. You're a dark mage, are you? You murder our allies in cold blood! Our sacrifice won't be in vain. Today, the world will be rid of another child of the darkness, and we'll move on, move one step closer toward the light. Oh, maybe Azriel is a. Uh... Maybe he's. No, no, get away, Miss Demon, help me. Homosexual. Nah. You only use any of your demon magic, witch. Your miserable life ends here. I'm a Cinder! <laughs> oh my god. This is for our allies. No! My my. Three big strong men against one little girl. Chivalry really is dead. Who said that? Who's there? Do you have any idea how frustrated I've been lately? How difficult it has been to swallow my shame? Anger and humiliation. Being forced to care for a human, and a girl at that. Do you have the slightest idea how demeaning that is for a succubus? What, what the? All I wanted was a little alone time to unwind. Is that just so much to ask? Just a little time to myself to escape this perpetual nightmare. But no, you idiots had to come along and ruin everything. Come on, show yourself, demon! Normally I would send you to heaven in the greatest ecstasy any man could ever experience, but my night out is ruined because of you. I'm in a very, very bad mood. That's why... I'm going to kill you as painfully as possible. Stay back! I I'm warning you! I can smell your fear, human. It smells absolutely delicious. <laughs> Miss Demon, I was so scared. All right, that's enough with the tears. Servants of darkness don't blubber in front of their enemies. Bless it, you're bleeding. 
If Ragnarok sees this, I'm as good as dead. I felt a disturbance in the child's darkness. What has happened here? Speak! The child is injured. No, no. There's a perfectly good explanation for this. You have failed in your duty, succubus. Now you pay the price for your incompetence. No, I did the best I could. It's not my fault. Don't! Stop! What? What are you doing? I won't let you hurt Miss Demon. Insolent child, you dare to defy your master? If you hurt Miss Demon, I won't be your carbinder, herbinder. I won't help you anymore. You would threaten me? I could snuff out your life like a meagle candle flame, mortal. Go ahead. If you do, who's gonna open portals for you from now on? Huh? Who? Very well. I will excuse her failure this once. However, the next time she disappoints me, her punishment will be twice as excruciating. Those who disappoint me meet a terrible fate. You would be wise to remember that girl. You... you saved me. Of course I did, silly. We're friends, remember? <laughs> oh, friends, huh? That's not a word you hear very often in the Abyss. I guess you won't go home now, huh? I'll send you back, okay? Oh, I'm not going anywhere. Not until I told you a bedtime story. Really? You mean it? Thank you, Miss Demon. Don't get used to this. I'm only doing it just this once. I hate being in other people's debt. Yes. I could call me Miss Demon. It makes me sound old. My name is Lanet. Lan if. What are you saying, Miss Lanith? Yes, 100%. <sighs> Alright, that's enough. Just hurry up and get in bed already. Zemsi. <laughs> Once upon a time, I saw the biggest, blackest. <clears throat> oh, that was cute. There's so many scenarios. I definitely like you. That is so weird, Cinder. Oh, the Serbius sucking up. Let's go to the throne room and proceed with the game. It's about time. My lord, what is your will? Take me to the Ebony Cauldron. As you command. I think it just. Ah, that's what's behind that weird. weird door thing. Ooh, look at his death. Behold, the Ebony Cauldron. Um, it doesn't look like a cauldron, though. More like a pit. <laughs> What's cooking up, God? This cauldron has the power to find magic, to find darkness into pure magical energy. Magic stronger than anything a mere human could ever hope to conjure. It's glorious, my lord. This device should be the means through which I ascend to the heights of power. Once it has been filled with enough darkness, I shall absorb its power and be reborn into an almighty deity without peer. With this newfound power, not even Lumiel's strength will rival mine. She and her precious humans will be helpless to stop my conquest. After I've ascended, you, Pandora, shall summon me to the human realm, where I shall remake the world into a realm of darkness. And then you should dispose of the monsters on Earth, so that the demons may rule in this new world, correct? I have not forgotten our agreement, Demon Lord, but know that the humans I have chosen to spare shall live on as my servants. I am certain that the humans will make excellent slaves, my lord. 
Wait, what? Calm down, boy. As Lord Ragnarok's loyal servants, we shall help him rule over the new world. Demons and dark mages shall hold dominion over all. Indeed. However, in order to make this dream a reality, we will, need, we will require an enormous amount of dark power. And just how are we going to harvest all that power? Silence, fool! Do not interrupt Lord Ragnarok! Touchy, touchy. Two centuries ago, in the short time that the portal linking the Abyss to the Mortal Realm was open, I used my power to scatter hundreds of bloom crystals across the world. <clears throat> They've been feeding off human hatred, suffering, and misery ever since, converting it into dark energy and storing it within themselves. As expected, your wisdom and foresight are unparalleled, my lord. Still, the power they have collected is not enough. At their current rate, it will take them at least another 50 years for them to collect the energy I need. We must expedite the process. And how do you intend to do that? We simply need to spread as much fear and chaos as possible, so that the gloom crystals might gather more might gather power more quickly. Hey, Obsidian. <clears throat> At the same time, we must strengthen our forces, tightening our grip on the world. Once Lumio's puppets learn of our machinations, they will no doubt rise up to oppose us. We will require an army of equal strength to crush them. We will slaughter the heroes of the world, and with them, all hope for salvation. Humanity's despair shall feed my crystals well. World domination, huh? Sweet. I always wanted to do something like that. <sighs> Why did we recruit him again? Our first target shall be Lindale, home of Lumilin, the school of magic. As in the place where most mages. As in the place where most mages go to learn magic? Why there? I'm not too fond of, you know, getting burned, frozen, or electrocuted. Take it, fight harder. <laughs> At the top of the tower near uh, Lindale lies a crystal known as Goddess's Arc Light. It's a symbol of Lumiel's power. We are going to destroy it. The fools have been drunk on peace for so long, the shock of losing their precious bauble will send them into a frenzy of panic and fear. Perfect fuel for the gloom crystals. Brilliant as always, my lord. Azriel, you are to accompany the humans in completing this task. Cut down anyone who stands in our way. It would be my distinct pleasure, my lord. The fools who stand against you shall die screaming your name in horror and despair. Tch, what a kiss up. I have spoken. Return to Azrael's throne room once more when you are ready to depart. Yeah, Azrael, join the party! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Really good right now. May the darkness guide all the fools of the pits to eternal torment and despair. Even I can't help but find this place unsettling. I'm certainly glad I'm, I'm, I'm certainly glad I'm on Lord Ragnarok's side. Oh, okay. Same thing. Anything. It's been fully healed. We're gonna go to the throne room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, then. It appears as if we're ready to depart. Whoa! Put the brakes on the airship for a minute, sister. What is it? We have no time to waste. Each second we spend here is another moment the world of men is devoid of screams of agony. Right. Well, I hate to put a damper on the festivities, but... Won't we look a little suspicious throwing around with that demon with fire coming out of his hands? I mean, hey... Why don't we just hang signs around our necks and say, We're dark mages! Please kill us! Hmm. You have a point. I've made that a problem where I, where I feeble human sorcerer. But for a demon of my power, it is hardly an issue. Behold. My, my. Impressive. For a demon, that is. I should don this form while we are inside human provinces. Those ignorant fools will never know the difference. In battle, I shall reveal my true, glorious form, and Ragnarok's enemies shall tremble at its sight. If you finish with your childish theatrics, it's time we departed. But all who live in the light fear our coming, for the vengeance of those they have spurned is soon at hand. Oh, cool. 
Plan accordingly. Ha ha ha. Okay, so there's the hut with the grandpa. Can we also be a fortress? All right, I can't get in yet. I need to find the side quests is the thing. What's the vision of the world dimension thing? Get out of the castle. What? It's a serious question. That a thing. Oh, no, we don't want to go inside the past just yet. Or do we? No, we don't. Uh, let's see our skills. Summon. Uh, no, they haven't. That w the bandit pass is up north. Right there, see? Or well, Northern Pass with the bandits and all that, but you, you know what I mean. Ha ha ha. Okay. Well, Lindale is where we're supposed to go, so Lindale, we shall go. Easy magic crystals and overgrown lanterns. What a waste. Oh, you're new to town. Bet you've never seen a magic circle before, huh? That's a bet you lose. Just step on top of it and whoosh! Maybe on the other side in a flash. Only fool the intellect of a slime would know something like that. You incompetent. I mean, I didn't know that. Thank you very much. Sh sure. Mm, I don't really hear it. Casey, come on out. You promised you'd play with me. You know, magic can help accelerate the growth of crops. That just certainly is amazing, isn't it? More than you know. Oh shit, she's evil. Can you feel it? There's magic in the air. Living in a place like this makes you feel truly alive. I'll see if I can fix that for you. It, that could be it, yeah. Do you want to build a snowman? Yes, we are the bad guys in this game. I sure wonder what it is I'm cooped up in here while my husband is outside tending the garden. You see, we have a child on the way, and he spared me for many physical tasks, for, for as many physical tasks as possible. Praise Lumiel that I was able to marry such a kind-hearted man. Alright, let's go steal from them. Alright, what's going on here? Teaching the goddess. More fabricated rubbish to start animosity against dark mages. Nothing yeah, here. I'm not sure why I expected otherwise. Dress forged of shadows, which these are nothing but rags compared to the garb I wear. This dress forged of shadows, which fills me with the power of darkness. So I think not. Ugh, I mean, he's not like Lanneth. I've been around that succubus far too long. Yeah, well, you know what? We're trying to steal from the people. We're not your heroes of the story. It's a friend growing up. The only friends I had growing up were the succubus, a fire breathing dragon, and the physical incarnation of humanity's collective evil. You had a fucked up childhood, kid. Incorporating hydroflora root into your garden. And cool five minutes before serving. There. It's just about done. Oh, excuse me. My family are just about to have dessert. I'm sorry, but I'm afraid there won't be any to go around. My kid inhales desserts like they're nothing. This kind of reminds me of... I can't stay in this place much longer. Uh... So cook ever. Hey, Daddy, come on down! Mom says the pie's almost ready! Oh, 
no. She's feeling bad because of things. Oh, no. Pandora, no! Oh, excuse me. Hey, old lady, help me count. I'm gonna beat my record. You just call me old. N never mind. You're supposed to know the flowers. Uh -huh, I can't. I'm gonna break my record for sure this time. I'm gonna tell mommy on you. Better not. <laughs> Is it really a kid for those kids to be playing with the pub like that? Where are their parents? Busybody. Magic this, magic that. People don't know how to do anything for themselves anymore. I'm telling you, magic, magic is going to be the death of us all. One can only hope. Oh, okay, so we don't need weapons or armor because we carry a forge from the Lord of Darkness. Yeah, I can't very, can very well. Can I? My prices can't be beat. Uh, yeah, they can, actually. You, uh, you, you are, what? Hey, Duchess, how you doing? Come on, cheap. Oh, uh-huh. Oops, I missed it. Okay. Whoosh! Oh, my God. Look at that. Whoosh! Yeah, okay, we're doing it. Five more what? Oh, nice! Congratulations! These Lumios crystals help keep the town lit at night. They're so much more beautiful than simple lanterns. I could stare at them all day. Public Guard, please keep your voice on side. Please be quiet and courteous to the other readers while you're here. Thank you. Entrance exams and screening process for Lumio. Uh, Lumio. I did totally say rigorous. Oh, excuse me. They have to be to ensure no dark mage has slipped through and undermine the school's security. Oh, heaven forbid that happened. Maybe. There's a lot of typos. Jeremy, hold me tighter. Huh? I'm studying for the interesting I'm beginning in Lumiel. Uh, Lumiel, please don't bother me. Let's see, the best spell to use against the slime would be... Was it Fireball? Fred about a girl who was adopted by Lumiel as her mother. How revolting. She likes Pokemon! Yep, yep. Fairy tale Slanif told me as a child always gave me nightmares. How dreadfully boring. My goodness, ancient times are filled with such violence and bloodshed. I'm glad we don't live in such a world like that anymore. And yet. You are joking, aren't you? Get ready. This is the best place in town to get some shut eye. Say you by this place just knocks me out in seconds. <laughs> oh, really? Which one? Excuse me, do you mind? Hey, shut lady, I'm trying to sleep here. The town of Lindale was actually built under the Lumi Ellen long after it was first opened. Oh, the, the weird, uh, oh god, I can't think of the name of it, but one, you need to pick Pikachu or Eevee, right? Gun winners. The number of aspiring mages flocked to the school to learn. It seemed only natural to capitalize on the potential business. Hey, Pokemon, let's go, that's it. That's fascinating. I never asked for a history lesson. Why are you talking to people then? Let's put a book on the table, so don't touch it, okay? Okay, that's the library. So <laughs> be careful, oh my god. Oh. Please don't touch the answers without permission, miss. She's starting to get on my nerves. Careful, miss. So my enemies can still my throat while I sleep. No, thank you. Uh, all right then. Please come back to stay with us soon. She's a strange one. Chef. I can't believe they expect me to cook in this broom. 
This is an outrage. I think it says broom closet. Oh, that's all. Oh, man. To be perfectly honest, I'd rather be at the pub right now, but at least my wife is happy. Terrible things happen when, when my wife isn't happy. Happy wife, happy life. The food here is absolutely incredible. So much delicious food. Should I take a little bit of everything, or just eat my weight in cake? For the best of hotel guests only, miss. She have eyes in the back of her head. Lots of cake. Mm. I'll take a room. If I do, I'll let you know. All right, miss. She's never playing at me. Okay, no, we can't get room. It is so warm in here all of a sudden. Ugh. Sorry, I'm just, I'm, I'm kind of feeling a little out of it right now. You have to forgive me. Nothing. Damien? Is that you? Sister Claire? I always need sleep. I, I don't feel that well, Duchess. Strip the cinder, oh, you know, that's what he wants. That's what he gets. But you gotta pay me. That's a, that's a one-on-one -on -one show. Having fun with your new friends, are you? I hope you're not getting yourself into any trouble. That's <laughs> so close. Me? Trouble? As if. <laughs> so, uh, what are you doing here? I thought a change of scenery might be nice. Besides, these people need to know that Lumiel is still watching over them, even if we cannot see or hear her. There's a comforting thought. Oh, I'd almost forgotten. There's someone who came by the church who was asking for you, Damien. It seems he had an urgent matter to discuss with you. Someone's looking for me. This guy didn't happen to be covered in armor and have a big pointy weapon, did he? Oh, Damien, you always did have a unique sense of humor. There's something about that man, though. Something in the felt... off. Truth be told, he frightened me. So I used this trip as an excuse to get away from him. Please, Damien, if you're going to have dealings with that man, be careful. I can sense something dangerous about him. Well, these are just RTP characters. These are, these are the base characters in the game. So, several games I play will have these if I play this type of, you know, VX Ace and all that. Don't you worry about me, sister. I can handle myself. Ooh, the mysterious visitor. Okay. How do I do that one? Oh, names, huh? It would seem that someone is in search of the boy. Should this individual prove to be in some manner of hero, it would be wise to cut them down before they become a threat. Head to Redding Cathedral and discover their identity immediately. Okay, cool. Yeah, let's do it. Forget the main quest. We're doing side quests! Yeah! Actually, um, let's see. Dark magic, abyssal portal. Okay, let's. But Azriel, you came to see me? Your work is pitiful. In what world would this filthy dwelling be considered clean? Stop taking your duties most seriously, or I will throw you out into the abyss with the beast where I found you. Yes, Lord Azriel. He talked to me. Here, mother, we'll take good care of Mr. Spandora. You can count on us. I highly doubt that. Okay. I've always admired Lord Azrael. For as long as I've had the honor of serving under him, he has worked for a better future for our kind. <laughs> you make him sound like some sort of hero. To us, he is. He may seem harsh and cruel at times, but what he does, he does not for himself, but for the good of all demon kind. <laughs> Lord Azrael, I didn't see you there. No, no, don't let me interrupt you. Feel free to continue gushing my life story to these filthy humans at your leisure, you loudmouthed wench. I, I, I'm sorry, my lord. I didn't mean... Hmm. This could be interesting. Tell me, girl, can you fight? I know if you protect your spells, but I'm a maid. I'm afraid I can't fight at all. Good enough. Oh, there we go, there we go. Now we got the summon. What was that? 
Explain yourself, witch. I simply formed a pact with the poor dear. I wouldn't want her to miss her beloved Azrael while we're gone, after all. Absolutely not. She cannot fight. She's a maid. Our enemies would slaughter her in mere moments. So you do care. <laughs> Please do not worry for me, my lord. I have enough magic to protect myself. Besides, I want to be of use to you, Mr. Spandora, any way I can. Do what you will, but I will not hesitate to cut you loose the moment you become a burden. Let's settle then. While we're out, you can tell me all about Azriel's deepest, darkest secrets. I swear once Lord Narak is done with her, I will slaughter this woman. Jimora, yeah! Doubting Servant of the Dark. Nice, okay. Jamora. I'm here to serve you, mistress. Oh, neat. She does go away from it. Cool. Damien. Okay, let's, uh... Let's go back and, uh, see what is waiting for me in the town of Reddin. Oh yeah, it's a good idea. Let's see what... What can Demora do? Immunity Sigil. Let's start with Allies and Shield. It grants immunity to negative status effects for seven turns. Dematic and Arcane Shield. Okay. Oh wow, that's kind of cool. A double Demon... <laughs> Look at all these human insects scurrying about. Disgusting. Oh, it snowed here too, Duchess. I think it's still snowing, actually. Alright, I should probably save, though. Oh, no. Damn it. Head for the innermost chamber of the crypt. I'll be waiting for you. Did did anybody else hear that? Indeed. But it seems we are the only ones who could. The communication they can all be heard by those touched by darkness. It seems this individual is aware that the boy is a dark mage. Interesting. This may yet be a worthwhile endeavor. Come, let us see what this mortal wants of us. Don't I get a say in this? Of course not. Let us not linger in this repulsive place. The sight of it makes my eyes burn. Me too, Azrael. Me too. Ah, I don't like it. Innermost chamber of the crypt. We'll save our game right here. Right now. Let's go. It's a rat. Squeaky squeak, little motherfucker. Squeaky squeak. Oh, is it the fallen? Yeah, fuck the fallen. I should keep going. <laughs> Diablo, welcome. Stay a while and listen. <clears throat> Stay a while and listen. I need to go the other way. Uh okay, okay. all right, what's going on? Oh, music changed. Something's going down. Greetings, descendant of the betrayer. I'm so very glad to receive my summons. Let me introduce myself. My name is Cynthia Ramoris. So you know who I am, huh? Did you come here to try and kill me? Please say yes. I'm really in the mood to have someone stab themselves. Come down, you fool. You should be able to tell just by looking at this man that this man is a dark mage. Hmm. What's, uh... It is just as Siege says. I assure you, I am not your enemy. <sighs> That's kind of a bummer. You have me all psyched up to kill you and everything. 
All right, what do you want? An autograph? What you want is for you to fulfill your destiny as the inheritor of Reinhardt's legacy. We? Oui. Yes. V. The Order of the Eternal. The perpetuators of Reinhardt, the betrayer's legacy. With your help, we will see his dream fulfilled. For too long have we, have we dark mages been abused by society. The time has come to create the world that exists only for us. I like what I'm hearing. Go on. Our organization exists for one reason only. To resurrect Reinhardt the Betrayer. Resurrect Reinhardt? Why would you want to do that? Reinhardt is the only dark mage who fully mastered the summoning spell capable of bringing Ragnarok to this world. If we were to bring him back and have him summon the Dark God yet again, V, his loyal servants, would claim dominion over the world. You do realize Ragnarok is already hit. Ow! What was that for? Stop and think for a moment, you fool. Reinhardt could prove to be a powerful ally. If these mages own the truth, then we no longer wish to revive him. Fine, fine. Did you have to hit me so hard? <laughs> Booty slap! Oh my god. It's supposed to be Russian. It's, it's very... Or maybe Ukrainian. I don't know. It's... 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 I, I don't know. You, you, you shut up, Cinder. I don't... I... Vodka. I want some vodka. Alright, Hoods. So what is it you need of me... I need me to do that some random dark mage off the street can't. I don't know. I I want something unique and di oh my god! You know that I'm so done with you people. I swear to God, I'm going to get myself a tall glass of vodka and walk out of here. I swear to God. The ritual of resurrection can only be performed by one who possesses the betrayer's blood. You are his last living relative. Okay, it's kind of a mix of maybe Ukrainian and like Transylvania. <laughs> I mean, yikes! Oh, sorry, God. However, I'm afraid there is another element we've yet to acquire. A powerful tome infused with necromantic energies. <laughs> the tome is the result of decades of research in the world of the dead. It lies within a hidden facility underneath Ethio Sanctuary. If you know where it is, why have you not claimed it yourselves? You have to be trying to play us for fools, would you? Sadly, all of our attempts to procure the book have failed. The sanctuary is guarded by powerful paladins who would undoubtedly recognize our faces and attack on sight. Of course, I'm sure retrieving it would be a simple task for you. The power of Reinhardt's blood flows through your veins. Fine then. I'll bring you your precious book. This ritual of yours had better succeed. I do not react favorably toward those who waste my time. I promise you, your efforts shall not be in vain. Once you've entered the sanctuary, the entrance to the underground research facility should be hidden under the third statue on the right. I know you shall succeed where we have failed. Good luck, my friends. Hmm. Damien's not happy. You know he's playing us, right? Perhaps. We are using him as much as he is using us. He's most likely the only one who knows how to perform this ritual of resurrection. If the order attempts to betray us with Reinhardt has revived, we'll simply dispose of them. Whatever. Let's just get this over with. Ooh. Reinhardt the Betrayer Part 1. Which means I have to go back to bed. Yeah, Part 1. Oh no! Oh no! Maybe I should have given him this voice. Oh no! Huh? 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 No, that's that's terrible. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Okay. Um. No, not you. Skills in you. Dark magic. Portal. Oh my God, Cinder! What the fuck? There we are. Reinhardt the Betrayer, Part One. Let's do this shit. Side quest. No. 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 
Where is it already? Lyra, this is ridiculous. I can't believe you're talking us into sneaking into Reinhardt's home. Seriously? The guy saves our butts from a gang of cultists, and you still think he's up to no good. You got some serious trust issues, Lai. For all we know, he could be working with them. He might have planned that ambush so he could swoop in and save us to make himself look good. Lyra, that seems a bit far-fetched. Far-fetched might bite. Last night I saw a creepy purple glow coming from this house. I'll bet you anything Reinhardt's hiding one of the shards of malevolence here. He's probably keeping it in some secret room connected to a hidden switch somewhere. I just gotta find it. Why is it so difficult for you to believe Reinhardt is an honest man? Is it because he's a dark mage? What? No! I'd never be ignorant enough to judge someone by their magic. And there's the rub, folks. The original heroes of old do not judge people for their magic, and yet the people today do because they are dark mages. Ridiculous. Utterly ridiculous. Then what is it? Why don't you trust him? It's... It's just a feeling, okay? Something about him gives me the creeps. He's hiding something. I'm gonna find out what it is. Judging by these notes scattered about, he does seem to be researching something, but... What I can tell, the only thing Reinhardt's guilty of is being a slob. If that were a crime, Rowland here would be the greatest villain of all time. I find your sense of humor unamusing. Bingo! Am I good or am I good? For, for real? No way. There really was a secret passageway? Y'all can tell me about how sorry you are for downing me on the way down. I like these little scenario things. And I like how they made it optional too. You don't have to do this. It's there for you whenever you want to go through it. I like I like that a lot. It's, it keeps um I don't feel it takes you out of the story, the main story, because you are in total you're in total uh, control of when you do these. I suppose. Even Lyra has her moments. Indeed. It's hard to pursue her before she gets herself into trouble. Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. I need to I need to play your game. I'll play it on stream one of these days. What is this place? I've never seen crystals like these before. They appear to be teeming with dark magic. What I tell you guys, if this place doesn't scream evil lair, I don't know what does. There must be a reason. I hate to admit it, but this does look pretty suspicious. Larry might actually be right on this one. Oh my god, Chibi, I played all of your games. A less dignified woman would stick her tongue out and say, I told you so. But lucky for you, I'm more mature than that. Mature. Right. Hey, look up ahead. Just check out that glow. He's got to be hiding the shard of malevolence in there. Come on, let's go. Mira, don't rush off on your own. Honestly, she's been like this ever since we were kids. It's always ask first and think second. I have to admit, my curiosity's peaked as well. If one of those shards does lie ahead, we'll be one step closer to our goal. I still think this is too easy. What are the chances we'll be able to... Nab a shard without having to wrestle a giant monster for it. Our track record hasn't been exactly stellar. True. All the more reason not to let Lyra go in there alone. Let's go! Oh, God, Chibi. Whoa. Whew! I can't whistle. <laughs> Wait. <clears throat> Looks like Reinhardt's got quite the setup here. But that doesn't look like a shard of malevolence to me. <laughs> it's not. It's a woman. Damn. Reinhardt's got some kinky taste. A woman? Is she alive? Your life force seems stable. But it's like she's been frozen in time. We have to save her. Lyra, use your magic. Wait, what did I... I'm <clears throat> sorry, what? Right. Don't waste your energy. Your magic isn't nearly strong enough to break the seal. 
Busted. Explain yourself, Reinhardt. Who is this woman and why do you have her frozen in your basement? Alright. I'm calling it right now. I'm calling it right the fuck now. Reinhardt didn't bring Ragnarok on purpose. He was maligned by history. He wasn't the real betrayer. How much you want to bet? Reinhardt's Dr. Fro- God, you're right! This woman is my light. I am devoid of emotion. <laughs> hey everybody! Chill! <laughs> no, he's not the bad guy. I'm calling it. I'm gonna make I'm I'm making a guess right now that he's not the bad guy. Yeah, because that's <laughs> This woman is my light, my hope, my one and only reason for living. <laughs> he's Mr. Okay, no, I'm not gonna do that for him. My beloved Cecilia. Your beloved? Please, allow me to explain. Don't, don't do that! <laughs> On the day that the rifts between our world and the abyss started appearing, a demon materialized here in our basement. Unfortunately, my Cecilia was here when it happened. But the creature that appeared was no ordinary demon. It was an archdemon, the most powerful breed of demon capable of casting spells within the highest tier of dark magic. In the case of my beloved in the prison of Daemonite, a naturally occurring crystal normally only found in the abyss. Daemonite is one of the hardest materials in existence, resilient to both force and magic. I toiled endlessly to break the spell, but no matter what manner of magic I used, nothing was strong enough. I wasn't strong enough. Eventually, I came to realize that the only way to break the spell would be to counter with a spell of equal force in nature. Fighting fire with fire, if you will. But I am no demon. I knew that I would never be able to conjure up such a tremendous force of dark magic on my own. That is why... You wanted us to use the Shards of Malevolence. Correct. The Shards of Malevolence are the crystallite remnants of the Dark God's power. Spawned from when he was first born centuries ago. With that power, I've no doubt I would be able to free my Cecilia from her eternal imprisonment. I don't care about using the shards to close the rifts. However, I did not lie to you when I told you I wanted to use them to save the world. Because the truth is, she is my world. Reinhardt! I beg of you, all of you, please, help me find the shards. We can use them to close the rifts in the world as you intended, but please let me use them for her sake as well. Help me. Help me save my world. Cinder, <laughs> god damn it. Of course we'll help! <laughs> what? Jeez, if you wanted to help us to help you out, all you do is ask. We're heroes. Sin people is what we do. Reinhardt, we'd be more than willing to help you fulfill your mission. We will not rest until Cecilia has been freed. Indeed, we can count on our strength in your quest to rescue your beloved. Working as one, we will save both your world and ours. I am a loss of for words. The near strangers would show such kindness. Thank you. Thank you all. I have not known you long, yet I can tell you are all true friends. It would appear we've all misjudged your intentions. All of us owe you an apology. Isn't that right, Lyra? Yeah. This is a creepy, creepy dungeon. <laughs> okay. Reinhardt, I'm sorry. I thought you were up to no good, but all this time, you were just trying to save someone special to you. Please forgive me. No, Lyra. It is I who should be sorry. I should have been more upfront about my intentions, but I didn't know if I could trust you with the truth. That is one mistake I shall never repeat again. From this point on, I do hope you and I can be friends. Don't be silly. We're already friends. Uh, oh god. Sister Abatekako. <laughs> oh wow. Gotta get more uh, scenarios. Okay, so. Um, here's the next part. It's an Edeo Sanctuary. Okay, so let's, uh, let's head back there, yeah. 
dark magic. Alright, where is Ethio's Sanctuary? Oh, is that the castle? No, that's a man. Okay, no, it's not bad. Ah, right there. Halt! No one is allowed inside! Shut up and get out of my way, you losers. Dark Mages! I'm in a seriously bad mood right now. I think I'll take it out on you. Fall into dice. Cause one inner dice will like a wellspring. As MG regen to one alley for Ooh. Ooh, that's kinda neat. I like that. Yes. Dance for me! Alright, dark magic. I like his armor. Infernium Ultima. Dark magic. Um. So she is purely healing. Succumb to the darkness. I just want to try and try and uh, level her up. Whew. I know, right? I like it. And HP regen. Holy shit! That's cool. I like that. Oh, can I? Oh, no, I can't. Yeah. Ashen Flame. Ooh, let's, let's burn them with ash. Succumb to the darkness. Like twice per turn for three turns. What? That's kind of cool. It's an extremely good. Oh god. Badass, you get to pick what oh wow, I like that a lot. I like that actually quite a bit. I don't know why I don't stand. Oh generic, I think it's a graphic. God. Huh. I feel better already. Come Damien, there's work to be done. Yeah, yeah. You sure you like bossing me around, don't you? He was so young. What a pity. <laughs> Shouldn't have run should have run when he had the chance. Are we gonna get moving or are you just gonna gloat over the corpses of our enemies all day? Hmph. Hmph. Harumph. 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 Filthy lies. These teachings are what drove dark mages into exile. Well, soon it will be their turn to run and hide. Hmm. Won't budge. Santa said to move the third statue on the right, if I recall. Oh, yes. Third statue right. This one? No. Okay. That was more like the second statue on the right, but whatever. What a secret side beneath this church. Let's find out, shall we? Another crypt. Lovely. 
Let's just grab that stupid book and get out of here. Demon magic. Hmm. Interesting. Seems like some of the tones survived. Oh my. Oh. Let's explore a little first, though. Oh, shit. Okay, let's save. I don't know what the fuck that is, but, uh... We're saving just in case. A seal? Hmm. And a rather powerful looking one at that. See, someone's rather adamant about keeping intruders from entering this place. This pitiful mortal barrier is nothing against the power of darkness. <clears throat> All things crumble. Stand back. Be prepared, my servants, for I sense a malevolent presence behind these doors. Let nothing stand in your way. Alright, let's go here first, then. Incorporeal reanimation. Hmm? See, someone has been dabbling in forbidden magic. These books, they're all dark magic tomes. Interesting. It does, doesn't it? Seems they're attempting to summon something with this ritual. Amateurs. Ugh, a stench is unbearable. What are they doing down here? Blood rites? Such a primitive form of dark magic. This cult seems rather zealous. You should be flattered, my lord. It's only natural for mortal insects to revere a god such as myself. Ooh, three demons draughts. What is what is a demon draught? Um, there's someone. Oh, oh, sweet. Maybe I should use it to level up my healer. I just wanted her to learn another skill, okay. Ah, this looks like it will come in handy. Oh, so we have to go through that, Erica. Hold on a moment. And what have we here? Pages from a journal of some sort? Let's see what our little amateur necromancers have been up to, shall we? Journal entry 4849. There's a darkness growing in the church. I can feel it. Lumiel's teachings have been warped, twisted into something ugly. We once spoke of compassion, yet now all I hear is hate. The church's growing resentment against dark mages has consumed this doctrine entirely. Hatred, death, persecution, this cannot be what Lumiel wants of us. Why does no one realize this? If only we could hear her voice once more, I'm sure she would condemn such foolishness. Sadly, our connection to her simply isn't strong enough. I'm more of a Guinness man myself, so. Solution to this problem, the deciding factor that will end the era of hate to reunite humanity with Lumiel, lies within a single soul. The soul of the great hero, Jeremy. Of all human beings, no soul has been more closely connected to Lumiel's than his. If only we could analyze if. Yeah, if only we could analyze the properties of his soul, we might learn how to strengthen our bond with her. Yet yeah, there is only one force that can summon a soul from the netherworld. The power of necromancy. I've already gathered a group of like-minded individuals to assist me in the task of summoning Jeremy's soul from the netherworld. In order to bring this world back into the light, we will dive headfirst into the, depth, into the depths of darkness. Interesting. All right, well, let's, uh, let's continue onward. <laughs> Intriguing. This place seems to be teeming with evil spirits. I never imagined I would feel darkness this menacing outside of the abyss. Is that touch of fear I hear in your voice, Asriel? Surely the mighty demon lord isn't afraid of a few evil spirits, is he? Continue to try my patience, and your spirit will join those in these catacombs, woman. Wait, evil spirits? 
As in ghosts? No one told me there would be ghosts. Stop your sniveling, Damien. The servants of darkness fear nothing. Least of all, some lowly group of spirits. I think it heard you. Oh, Sam, see <laughs> I, Guinness is basically a meal in itself. It's a very thick beer. Not like thick, but it's, it's, it's got some body to it. I drink like one every year or so. What? There are truly evil spirits here? Give it to me. Give me your body. Gah! Oh shit. Pandora? Pandora's not home anymore. Not home. Not anymore. <laughs> Useless human. Come, let's put a stop to this spirit before it completely consumes Lord Ragnarok's precious pet. Oh, the boss fight was her. Mine, mine, mine! This body is all mine! <laughs> Shoot. He's been possessed. <laughs> Give it to a weak minded human to be overcome by a mere ghost. He's got no choice but to beat her back to her senses. Okay, if she has more HP than what I started with, then I'm calling, uh, um, shenanigans. Ooh, nice. That's good, actually. Haha! <laughs> Eat it, bitch! Do you hear? What is that? I may regret this. Hey, Aaron, how you doing? How do I get that shield off of her? God damn it. Oh, something with like the chat it it doesn't show with the video at the same time actually pretty good. Um, it's Umbral Soul. I don't know if you've heard of it. You probably have, but you play the bad guys, basically. That's 
a good question. Aaron. God damn it. What does Umbra mean, anyway? Let's look it up. Umbra. The fully shaded inner region of a shadow caused by an opaque object, especially the area on the Earth or Moon experiencing the total phase of an eclipse. Ah. Ah, that's where I got my, uh... Antumbra, Penumbra, yep. That's where I got the idea for my book. The Gods Who Walk. Uh, Antumbra is actually the name... I, I kind of changed the spelling a little bit. It's the name of the world that's Tidelock that I made in my fantasy novel. me! Never! If I can have this body, then no one can! Enough! Be gone for my servant, lowly apparition. No, I... Oh shit, we killed her. Pleasant. I can lie. I enjoyed that more than I probably should have. Once again, your incompetence has proven to be a burden. I have no idea why Lord Ragnarok would leave his plans in the hands of such an inept human. Say that again, and I'll show you just how inept I really am. Well, it's all—it's all default RTP. It's a bunch of default stuff. Hey guys, we got bigger fish to fry right now. Story is pretty good though. I don't remember that slime ball Synther mentioned this place is infested with ghosts. Do you? When we get back, that scum that scumbag's gonna pay big t Okay, okay. As I just say, the story's great and all this. Oh god, nothing but typos. Okay. The human will be made to suffer for his treachery. But... Why don't you look at the instructions that are on it? It had some. Were they on the lid or on the package or anything like that? Uh, how do you know? Don't touch one. Okay. Um. See plastic cover for heating directions. You put the plastic cover back on and then you read it and follow have that. Have fun with your stream. You did that on purpose, didn't you? Get out of here, kid. <laughs> Careful, don't spill that. They do, Zemsi, a little bit. <laughs> the human made to suffer for his treachery, but only after he has revived Reinhardt. Until that time comes, you are not to harm him. Seriously? Lord Ragnarok has spoken. Now stop complaining and come along. I feel like I need to take a bath. Hot. Save our game, and okay, so which way are we going? You... Did you do this to me? Why? <laughs> my love, where are you? Where? Yeah, my love. No, I don't think so, Aaron. Did she just do zero damage? That would not surprise me one bit. I don't think I can make a puppet dance. 
What did we play? Oh no. Nope, can't. I should probably pay attention to the fact that I'm not doing any damage whatsoever to this thing. Taxes, oh god! <laughs> yeah, um, you're not wrong. <laughs> Was that not enough? I don't know Mog Hunter from a hole in the ground, so I think it's fine. Thanks for hanging out. We're gonna be uh, calling it uh, early pretty soon here as well. Oh, great, he's cursed. That's just wonderful. Why is he cursed? Oh my god. Succumb to the darkness. There we go. Ooh, ectoplasm elbow. Demon Dark Soul. Oh. Yeah, tonight I'm, it's just gonna be an early night. Yeah, um, she can summon different, uh... I can also have, a uh, uh, Succubus, too. Alright, let's have some fun. Fuck you, bitch! I'm gonna fuck you up! <clears throat> Sorry, what? Uh, let's see here. Uh, dog magic, actually. Let's bring back, um... Uh, the maid, though. Breath of fire. Because <laughs> she can, uh... Heal everybody up. There we go. And then we'll bring back... Actually, let's leave with her for a little bit. So much knowledge, but I already possess all the power I need. But again, suppose a bit more could have hurt. Let's look at this. The entire history of necromancy must be here. Where do they even get these? I've never played any of them. Ever. I should try. I, 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 I should find the first one and start with that. More trash. Where's that blasted book? I'm going to be rid of this dreadful place. This would be at least a half a decade's worth of research, and nothing else. I admire their dedication. Uh, what's this? A forbidden tome. Just not the one we're looking for. Let's 
spent some little boy who could. Oh god. Must have, okay, so that's the key to the other door. Oh, next journal. Seems there are more journal pages sprawled about here. Let's take a look. Okay, Aaron. Uh, you have yourself a good night. I will see you later. Yeah, I'm probably gonna be streaming for like maybe another 15 minutes or so. Because I gotta go take care of some stuff for my wife, and then instead of just stopping the stream for like 30, 40 minutes and taking care of it and then coming back, if it's gonna call it an early night. We've finally done it. Tomorrow I won't be. I work late, unfortunately, but I will be streaming on Saturday. After years of gathering and studying tomes on the dark arts, our efforts have finally borne fruit. We have successfully summoned a spirit. Now, at last, we can begin our research on the properties of the soul. <clears throat> our celebration was short-lived, however, cut short by the horrific screams of the apparition we had summoned. Oh, cool. I might be streaming earlier that day, too, because I'm off, so we'll see what happens. The spirit, the spirit appears to be in extreme pain, but why? Is this the result of an, imp of an imperfection in our summoning technique? The only way to learn more about the nature of the human soul is to analyze this one. We cannot turn back in the face of adversity. We must persevere. Night, man. Thanks for coming. I only hope this poor spirit can forgive us for what we must do for the good of all mankind. Alright, let's go, uh, open up that door. It was a bad guy. <laughs> Whoops. MP enhanced MP cost for five turns, but use it. Oh wow, that's a cool move. guys for some sort of thing. Um, ectoplasm. <laughs> the serious cell is glowing sludge, the better. Oh, another glowing skeleton. Give me your body! Kill a skelly. Alright, let's see here. Succumb to the darkness. Dodge this. Hmm. Nice and easy. I like it. May souls and tomb here find eternal rest. <laughs> if they only knew. Oh, fear. Oh, good, she resists. Heads. Oh my god, taxes, what the fuck? She really is worthless in a fight. I, that's kind of upsetting, but oh well. <laughs> Only good for uh... how great he's confused. Wonderful. Actually, <laughs> just slaps. <clears throat> oh, right, the spirits. This won't do anything because the only way they can do it is. Uh, God damn it! 
it. I'm just going to say because creepy laughs um, freaked me out a bit. Oh, where are we? It's a pity the world rejects dark magic so adamantly. It's such a waste of potential. Oh, there's the next thing, so that's going to be the... Hmm, nothing of importance. Do you think a place like this could be hidden beneath a church of all things? What amusing irony. Not here either. If this venture proves to be a waste of time, I'll make those fools suffer. This magic is far darker than anything I would even dare to attempt. East Wing Key? What? Let's see what we have for me at this time, my little necromancers. We've gained invaluable knowledge by closely studying the ethereal properties of the spirit we summoned. We've learned that in much the same way that demons are bound to the abyss, spirits have an invisible connection anchoring them to the netherworld. While in the realm of the living, this tether is constantly attempting to drag them back into the realm of the dead. As a real, the spirit is essentially being torn in two, causing an extreme, relentless agony, pain enough to provoke aggression and even madness over time. Perhaps this is why the spirit is so obsessed with possessing anything it could use as a body. It would be attempting to anchor itself to our world and firmly, and more firmly, to ease its pain. Dorothy has voiced her concerns over whether or not we should, be, whatever we are doing, is right. I believe the spirit's screaming is starting to get to her. Sadly, we still have yet to discover a method for returning our unfortunate guest to the netherworld. Perhaps we were to study a different spirit and may shed some light on the mysteries that continue to confound us. We must summon more. Oh my. Alright, so now we gotta leave. Go to the East Wing. I'm just gonna escape for now. I do, ZMC, I do. I don't really have many games for it though, and my son is the one who usually plays it more than anybody else. You leave Hawk Zombot alone, Chibi. Not to make a big dance, there we go. <laughs> Taxes. Ah, it's confused. Excellent. Ah, gotcha. And uh, lucky for me, I have a capture card. Got myself the Elgato. So I uh, I can hook that up to the Wii, or the, 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 the uh, Switch, and all that cool stuff. And... Nice. Skill string cutter. Hmm. Let's see what that does. So East Wing, that's got to be down at the uh, near the entrance. We didn't look that one yet. Why did you let me die? Right, so that's another point. You stream made dark magic. Control point for two. Ooh, nice. Come to the darkness. 
Should that have, like, reflected back since it was a magic thing, but whatever. <laughs> oh, she did. She did twice. That's how dead she is. Ten of a bit of power of Neckman. Reinhardt's restored me once again. And what's my Oh, he says what? Well, okay, so maybe Reinhardt was evil. Okay, maybe I was wrong this whole time. Yeah, damn it. Okay. Um, I know we're still doing this area, but I have to go. Because I gotta go help my wife with her stuff real quick, so. Um, it sucks. It's a short stream tonight, but I'll be back on Saturday. Swear to God. Reinhardt's a freeze. Good God. He really is, isn't he?